Welcome to our channel, in this video, we will see, what is the risk of pulmonary embolism during pregnancy. For more information, please click the links in the description. Pulmonary embolism is the leading cause of death in pregnant women, and yet it is not always easy to detect it. In this video, we will shed light on this subject, and explain the contributing factors as well as the possible treatments. What is a pulmonary embolism? Although unknown, this pathology is more frequent than it seems. Pulmonary embolism occurs when a clot that has formed in the legs, phlebitis, goes back to the heart and blocks the pulmonary artery. Pregnant women are more likely to be affected by this disease, with 1 in 1,000 pregnancies affected by embolism. In 30% of cases, the outcome can be fatal. What are the causes of pulmonary embolism? Why is the pregnant woman more affected? The first explanation is that the uterus, when enlarged, compresses the veins and prevents the blood from circulating properly. The hormonal fluctuations undergone during pregnancy can be an aggravating factor. Hormones, in particular estrogens, damage the wall of the vein, which can also undergo a real trauma during the delivery. Except pregnancy, hormonal treatments can also favor the development of phlebitis, that it is those which one undergoes within the framework of stimulation of ovulation, or with the pills of third and fourth generations, which have been the subject of many controversies recently. Symptoms of pulmonary embolism. If pulmonary embolism is so complicated to detect during pregnancy, it is because its symptoms are similar to those experienced by almost all pregnant women. For example, the feeling of heavy or swollen legs can be a sign of phlebitis, as well as being a common side effect of pregnancy. Just like gaining weight, feeling short of breath with the slightest effort, or heart rate. Which is accelerating. So many mild symptoms and completely common for most pregnant women, but which can also alert your doctor. It is then necessary to compare the different symptoms and family history to assess the risks and be able to make a diagnosis. How can we treat pulmonary embolism? As we have seen, if the clot is large, the pulmonary embolism can block the arteries and be fatal for the mother. This is why, as soon as the diagnosis is mentioned, the expectant mother is immediately treated with anticoagulants. These are heparin stings, which work faster than tablets. It is prescribed throughout pregnancy, and generally up to six weeks after delivery. The risk remains because the vessels were shaken at birth. The mother is then followed by a pulmonologist or a cardiologist to check that everything is back to normal. And during a future pregnancy, the doctor will prescribe preventive treatment to avoid the risk of recurrence. Thank you for watching, you can watch more videos by clicking the links in the description. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friend.